Now I'm going to talk to you a little bit about the ID tag. So I have, let's see, all these different divs. I have some spans. I have some butterflies. But look, I don't know if you've seen this, but I do have, that's the butterfly we used. I've got butter three, butter four, butter five. So I've got three other images that I could use here, one, two, and three. But how can I possibly do that? Because my div tags all have that image. So how would I change that? Ah, I'll show you. I'm going to go to my index and create some ID tags. So this div is going to be, what is that? Uh, let's do them one at a time. Uh, this div will be ID equals egg. Remember, I'm in my HTML document, so I need to type in HTML format. This is the attribute format. This div will be ID equals cat, even though that's not a cat. It's short for caterpillar. This div will be ID equals Chris, and this div will be id equals adult. All right, save. Now we're going to go over to our styles. You'll, you may be able to see that just because I added an id, but I didn't change the style, refresh, so nothing changes yet. Over here in style.css, now I'm going to add my ID tags. And the way you talk about the ID is with a hashtag. So I'm going to say hashtag, uh, let's leave butter1 on the egg. So that's uh, right there, butter1. So now I'll say hashtag cat, that's the second one. And that's all I need. The same image path, actually, the same image path. So I'm going to copy that. But this time, it's funny that there's not butter two, but anyway, this time I'm going to make it butter three. So I'm not going to add anything else. Let me get that where it belongs. Because I want to keep, I'm not going to override no repeat or right or center or padding. I'm just going to override the image. So I'll actually make this background image. All right, there's the cat. And now what's the other one? Uh, hashtag, was it Chris? Is that what's next? Yep. Yeah. C-H-R-Y-S. And once again, I'll paste that, but change the numeral to four. And I think the last one was hashtag adult. So the hashtag, again, stands for the word ID. And this is going to be butter5. Save and refresh. Oh, the only thing that did not happen was my repeating image. And I think that's because I forgot the hyphen image. Save and refresh. There we go. So now I have different butterflies and uh, my ID has been put beautifully on my divs. See, another good reason to use divs.